that's the bringing yourself down, which is very, very important. A lot of people teach motivation, um, confidence building strategies, but it doesn't matter who you are, what you do, you're going to have stress throughout your day. Some days are terrible. Some days are, are like a living hell. But you have to have some tools where you can switch off when you go home and on just unload all that stress from the from the physical body because it will house itself there it houses itself different emotions house themselves in different organs in different places and it accumulates so you have to have a skill and again if you don't have a solution for that then it turns to anxiety where that feeling of fight or flight is there all the time and then that will turn to depression in which there is three stages Third stage, the neurotic stage, is dangerous and people have irrational thoughts, okay? That I would train people in on how to deal with your rational mind because you can rationalize all day long, but if your irrational mind wants something, it's going to have it. It's the 88% of the mind. So it's like 12 people playing tug of war with 88 people. It doesn't matter if the 88 people are, you know, young skinny students against 12 bodybuilders, doesn't matter. You're not gonna win. If somebody's going into the workplace every day and they feel they're being emotionally bullied or they don't get on with somebody, yeah, same thing. Even before they open their eyes in the morning, they get the feeling. And they're walking into work forward every day, but the mind that controls the immune system, all the systems, is trying to pull them back and eventually it'll go, there you go, you're not going in today, you're sick. Your veritable bowel syndrome, maybe even down it's the like, line. You know, world champions in sport, they've all got coaches. They've all got people to, to keep an eye on them and, and talk to them. Although they're the greatest in the world, but they still need outside eyes. We all need outside eyes. It can be a friend, it can be a work colleague, it can be a coach. It doesn't matter, as long as it's something. Even personal development, you have to go over it. You can't just do it once and then that's you because we're always being programmed. So you have to be consistent in your practice with yourself, no matter what you're doing. There's people out there who sell you secrets to, you know, success or anything, you know, do it overnight, shortcut, no such thing.